What's going on guys? Today I'm going to give my honest review on Sprout Social and it might help you figure out if it's right for you. And I'm going to move really fast with this because I respect your time. Alright, so the first pro to using Sprout Social is that everything is here. When I say everything, I mean pretty much everything you can think of. Some of the other social media management tools have limitations. For example, some of them limit the amount of social profiles that you can connect per accounts. Sprout Social is really good with this. So a couple of my favorite features in Sprout Social is the Smart Inbox. This is gonna be a lifesaver for anyone that has a bunch of social media accounts. And what happens here is we connect all of our social medias. You know, you got your Instagram, you got your TikTok, your YouTube, and all of the notifications are in one place. So you're no longer Longer running around like a rabbit checking all the accounts on your phone Just, da, 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 da. that's not happening anymore this feature is a lifesaver and what's really cool is you can just click on like view thread and it will bring you directly to that page to the account if you want to reply there or you can just reply here my second favorite feature is the publishing and scheduling calendar this is super helpful because I can schedule out all the content across all my social media platforms this is I, I cannot stress how much of a lifesaver this is is. Just click on schedule post, create the post, choose which social media profile you want it to post to, the images, the reels, whatever you want to add here or post, you can post anything. Now what's really cool is you can add custom workflows. Uh, it's a little geeky, but once you get into it, it's going to save you a ton of time. You can add your hashtags, every little thing you could think of, you can publish with the scheduler. And you may think, oh, I don't need a scheduler. You know what I mean? That tells me you're not very serious about social media because if you're trying to just publish every single day, it's a lot smarter to get down to the nitty gritty and actually publish 30 posts scheduled and then just like unplug from it and then come back. What I do is have ChatGPT help me and I schedule out like 30 posts across all the socials. I do it once a month and then I unplug and I get to go concentrate on my business. All right, so the next cool feature is the reports. How do you know if you're growing on social medias without looking at the reports, right? And look at all this stuff you can get reports on. It's absolutely crazy. Profile performance, Google Analytics, you can connect a website in here, Instagram performance, competitors posts, you can look at your competitors posts. You can look at your post performance, any little criteria that criteria that you think you can look up analytics on Sprout Social has it figured out. Like this is my YouTube account on my 3D print channel and it is insane. Like the data is, I can't even explain to you how important it is. And guys, if you're on the fence about using Sprout Social, can consider using my affiliate link in the description to get a free trial just to try it. I'm confident that once you start using it, you're going to absolutely love it because it's just it's a crazy tool. All right, so now I want to talk about some of the negatives of Sprout Social because it can't, you can't, the world isn't just all positives. Let's talk about these negatives. So the biggest negative is probably the pricing of Sprout Social. And again, this changes from time to time, but if you pay for the annual plan, the standard is $1.99 per seat and it goes up from there. And obviously you get different features with different plans, just like every other membership on this planet. What I really like is the five social profiles. So you can have like a bunch of sub profiles in there and you can do five five different ones. So this is like really good for like if you were doing like an agency setting or something along those lines. Some people gripe about the pricing, but I think at the end of the day, this is a business expense and these tools like they're invaluable. Like you can't put a price on them if they're saving you time and growing your business like that. And we all know that social media growth is the secret sauce to growing today. Another negative that I have to say about Sprout Social is there is a little bit of a learning curve. You know, there's some things in here that you may or may not use that are like kind of like AI integrated. There's an X feed features that like I've never really even looked into. There's the social listening feature where you can like take, you can like put in cues or like learning words and it will like check to see what competitors are doing. And it's a really cool feature. I just really haven't taken the time to really learn it. And this people feature, again, I don't really even know what this does as well. I think it's kind of like um, talk, the people you talk with at times, maybe you can like kind of, nurture that relationship with people that are inboxing you and such. But I've reviewed a lot of these social media management tools and you kind of just need the basics. You need scheduling and planning. You need analytics and reporting. And then maybe some cool tools to let me know like what people are saying on the web about my brand, kind of some brand awareness, maybe competitor and analysis. There's also a review feature that is somewhat new to Sprout Social that a lot of people are craving, raving about. And I'm looking to get into this because uh, what you can do here is you can kind of manage all your reviews, which could be super important you know the Facebook reviews the Google my business profile reviews are so important right Yelp reviews etc and all you have to do is connect your page and then you can just like 
take a look at all your reviews here. You can manage your local reviews. So all in all, I'm extremely happy with Sprout Social. And again, if you guys want to check it out, the links will be in the description. I absolutely love the notification management system though. Like this is, I would pay for this tool in itself just for this because all the notifications in one place saves me so much time. When I have like seven social profiles, that all have notifications and messaging, etc., etc. This allows me to be on top of it. You guys, don't forget that Sprout Social has a phone app that is really easy to use. Say if you're on the go, if you're like driving with a friend or sitting waiting for a dinner, you can sit there and do the Sprout Social app and it works amazing as well. So am I happy with Sprout Social? Yes. My honest review is I would recommend it to any of my friends. I've done competitor analysis on all these tools because I run a marketing agency where I manage social profiles for companies and having the best tools helps me so much. Consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next one.